North Acton. I think being Japanese is quite uh, positive last few years, but fast because uh, I came here about 16 years ago, and the first few years obviously uh, it was quite tough um, being as a Japanese because for them uh, Chinese, Japanese, same thing, you know. <laughs> Because I never coached in my life in Japan and uh, since I came here I started knowing myself I, I like kids you know so being uh, with Japanese kids uh, I quite like it and then I feel at home because I never experienced it back in Japan as well so uh, it's good experience anyway. We started from under 7, 8, 9. We had about 40 kids to start with. Then we started growing, growing, growing. Now we have uh, under 16, and we have um, adults team playing uh, Sunday League and also um, Middlesex County Premier Division. Now, like we have 180 players, and then like uh, 60 to 70 percent is like. For now Japanese and then the rest of players are like locals and then British players. So now we are trying to make in the 50 and 50 Japanese and local peoples. Because here is uh, around the Japanese like community in the Acton. That's why the, we best in West Acton. The reason is the football for me. Yeah. yeah, because the football in this country, the football is the like for, for me the best country. And then uh, First player we I know is um, Lee Tadanari. He used to play for Southampton, and then since then, because uh, it's a small community, as I told you, because not so many Japanese are here. Then uh, Maya Yoshida is one of one of our ambassador. He's uh, also um, uh, he he went to Southampton, and then now he went to Sampdoria, and uh, he. He's always with us and he's always giving something to the club. He wants to give us, uh, give uh, uh, kids something, um, uh, how do you call them? I don't know how, uh, how to say that. Um, he wants to give something for the kids in the future, you know? Yeah, whenever the two players or three players come, they, uh, the, the kids are very excited. Uh, gives them something to aspire to, I suppose, um, and a role model in this country that is from their country who's doing very well by playing Yoshida, for instance, playing Premier League, and uh, the boy from Leicester was very good as well. Uh, they, they, they give up a lot of their time, more so than I probably would have expected. They come and do little bits and pieces. Uh, you'll see they did a nutritional talk there not, not long ago, so we came all the way up from Southampton and the kids came. And, uh, I, th I think it's excellent to be fair and uh, yeah, something for them to look up to. Some of the kids um, are more timid than others, so are happier with their own culture, particularly as they're learning English. I think when they come to terms with English then they they, they broaden out a bit and they, they become a bit more social. Um, but as you can see, there's a couple who don't really speak English uh, at all, really. Uh, I have to use Massa as a translator uh, or one of the other coaches, but sometimes your message doesn't quite go across with translation. Similar when I work in Spain. Um, does it go 100%? Uh, do they get your meaning? Do they understand the nuance of what you're trying to say? So like, I can all have a bearing. Hopefully to uh, attract a few more local boys and girls to try and make it a bit more diverse, which is I know the people in charge want, but also because 
If it's going to become self-sustaining, uh, we lose kids all the time for visa issues back to back to Japan. So um, we lost two in December, another one, possibly two in March. So and we lost five last year. So trying to keep uh, the numbers up to get 11 aside. Uh, this year we've been playing up until now most games with 10 men or nine nine players. So. That's been a challenge for the kids, but to be fair, they've been in most games even though they're playing players down. They've got them beaten, but probably apart from two games, they've been excellent, particularly whenever they're playing the players down. Yeah, obviously everyone is really good and really funny, so I'm always laughing when I'm playing here, so I love, I love it for playing here.